everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Danielle. Welcome if you are new or welcome back if you're returning. On my channel, you'll find things like luxury unboxing, handbag reviews, handbag unboxings, lifestyle, beauty, and more. So if that's something that you are interested in, I would love for you to subscribe and stick around and keep watching for my video today. So today I have an exciting video. I have a haul video I would like to share with you all. I have a collective haul of things I've bought over the last few weeks or so and um, I wanted to share. So I have stuff from Louis Vuitton, um, I have clothes from Abercrombie, and I have some stuff from Target, as well as makeup from Sephora. So I hope you enjoy my haul. So the first thing I'm going to get started is the place where I got the most stuff from, and that's Sephora. So I went to Sephora a few days ago, and I just went, and I, when I was walking around, I wasn't really looking for anything in particular, but I just decided to, um pick what I was feeling in the moment to be honest so the first thing I got is so I went to Ulta a few weeks back and I saw this in Ulta and I didn't buy it in the moment and I kept thinking about it and wanting to get it so I decided to get it at Sephora I have not used this yet um and it is the dry bar liquid glass smoothing shampoo so I got this because I love going to dry bar to get blowouts and things and I love the products they use on your hair. So I decided to go ahead and get this. Um, my next two items I got are from Tower 28 Beauty and I have never bought from this brand before. But I've heard amazing things. So the first product I got is the Shine On Lip Jelly Lip Gloss and go ahead open it up and I just got it in a clear gloss I have a lot of lip gloss in my makeup collection but I don't have a true clear gloss I have a lot of that have like a lot of shimmer that is kind of clear like the one I'm wearing today but it has um, glitter in it but this is a true uh, clear gloss and I got from Tower 28 so there you get a close up the other thing I got from Tower 28 is a um, is their Beach Please Luminous Tinted Balm. Now this is a, oh and the shade is in Magic Hour. And this is a tinted lip balm, but you can, but I would wear it as a blush. So they show it as both. Pull it out for the color. And this is <clears throat> the Blush and Magic Hour or Tinted Lip Balm as well. And it's a decent size. I mean, I love their packaging. It's this really nice, like, acrylic plastic. And it's really thick and it seems like it would be hard wearing. So I'm excited to try this. And I'm really into glowy makeup. I actually am not wearing any powder products today. This is all liquid products. So... I'm really into dewy makeup right at this moment, so I'm excited to try that. I have two other things from Sephora. Another liquid product is the from from Rare Beauty. It is the soft pinch dewy liquid blush in the shade Happy, and this is Selena Gomez's makeup line. I've always wanted to try it. I've heard really good things about it. I love the packaging. I love the sorry, let's shine. The sun is shining in. The um the packaging with the little handle at the top. And this is a liquid blush and it's in this really pretty pinky peachy color. Just kind of basic everyday shade and i've heard about this their blushes is that like a little goes a long way and you only need a teeny tiny bit and it'll it'll blend out really well but you can really overuse it by accident and the last product i got from sephora is this and this is the old plex number no. seven bonding oil I have never used this before as well as so all these products except for the dry bar shampoo I've never used 
But I've heard amazing, amazing things about this hair oil. I've seen a lot of TikToks and a lot of YouTube videos of people raving about this, how shiny and how healthy it makes your hair feel. And you use it on damp or dry hair. And yeah, so I've heard it reduces frizz, it extends color, it's a heat, oh, it's a heat protectant as well, which is good because I use heat on my hair. Um, it shortens drying time, detangles, all the good stuff. So I'm really excited to try this Olaplex number no. seven bonding oil. So what I got at Sephora, the next place I went shopping is Louis Vuitton. So as you can see by the bag, it's small. So you can guess I got and about the size of the box and SLG. So let me go ahead and wrap this. And when I went to the mall, this was a total um, kind of impulse purchase, but not really. I was thinking about this item, but when they had it in stock and I was just walking around, I was like, oh, let's go in Louis Vuitton and they had it. So I just bought it. So in here, I'm trying to see what this is. Oh, it's just the business card or the gift card. Here. I also have my um, receipt in here as well. So I'll take this ribbon part. So you can probably guess by the size that this is a wallet. I got the Louis Vuitton Rosalie Queen Purse in Damier a bend with a beautiful rose ballerine on it. And I am so obsessed. I am so in love with this. Um, I've been eyeing this for a while now. Um, and I love the Damier a bend print. And especially with this stunning, stunning. Uh, rose ballerine pink I was just looking to see and it's made in Spain which I wish was made in France but it doesn't really matter but when you open it there is a card slot in the back let me move this over card slot in the back there's this uh, another car little card slot here the main compartment there's my Louis Vuitton tag and then if I flip it around, I don't know how you'll see this, but right here, here is another card slot. And then in the center is the queen patch. So if you saw my what's in my bag video for my YSL mini Lou bag, you saw that I have a Lou uh card holder and I wanted to I have my Zippy wallet and I have some other Zippy wallets as well, but I wanted a Louis Vuitton one to kind of go along with my card holder. And because my card holder only really fits a few cards in my license and that's about it, I really wanted to have somewhere where I could put cash and coins because I do have ca carry cash sometimes with me and coins with me. And so I wanted to get something to go with my card holder, even though they're not the same print, but they're both Louis Vuitton. So I am so excited that I unboxed this so I can now put it to use. So that is my new Louis Vuitton Rosalie coin pouch in Damier Bend with Rose Ballerine. So, so the next place I went shopping, I shopped online at Abercrombie and I'll put the pictures up on the screen and I bought this online so I already took it out of the package so it's easier to show but I'll show the model wearing this. I got the 
These are the Abercrombie, the 90s straight ultra high rise. And this is the Curve Love um, style and this beautiful light wash denim. There is no distressing, there are no rips, which is what I wanted. And also, I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but you'll be able to see with the model, this hemline is the one where they um, go down into like a V on your waist. And it looks amazing on, and you can see it on the model as well. I have worn these already one time over this weekend. I went out wearing them and they are so comfortable. They, I, I um, they are so comfortable. I ate in them. I had, um, these jeans are so comfortable. I ate in them. I moved around. I was walking around a city in them and they were so comfortable and um, they fit so well. I love Abercrombie jeans and I wanted a light wash pair because I already have a uh, light wash pair that is distressed. So I wanted a pair that doesn't have any distressing. The second thing I got from Abercrombie and you'll be able to see it on this mo on the model is this long sleeve navy blue bodysuit. And this isn't anything really exciting, but Abercrombie with their reinventing of everything has really stepped up the quality and their bodysuits are really really thick the material is really great it's really stretchy and i really like the navy blue and i think this combo of the light denim and the navy blue together will look great with the little v on the curve love or on the style of these jeans um i'm really excited to wear this bodysuit in by itself with another pair of pants or with those jeans that I just say showed you. And last but not least, the last place I went was Target and I just bought a few things when I was getting some groceries at Target and I went to show you the extra things I bought. So in my January favorite so in my January favorites video I mentioned that I love to read and some books I love reading. So when I was at Target, I always get sucked in by their book section and I really couldn't say no to the books that I saw. So I have three that I got and these are all book talk, booktube, um, highly recommended books. And when I saw them there, I decided to get it. So the first one I got is called They Both Die at the End by Adam Silvera and in this book, it kind of gives away the ending, but not really. They both die in the end, but it's a story about these two people and they both find out that they're going to die in a day. And then they um, have 24 hours to live. So they have to figure out what they're going to do together in the last 24 hours of their life. So it's more than just that they both die in the end. So I'm excited to read this one. The second book I got is Red, White, and Royal Blue by Casey McKiston. And this book is about, it's like a United States president cross over with um, the royalty princes in the UK. So it's about these two people and how their lives cross being the first son and being a prince and how they fall in love and all these different things. So it is a love story. So I'm excited to read this one. And last but not least, this is a Good Girl's Guide to Murder by this is by Holly Jackson. And this is the first book in the series. Um, the next book is Good Girl, Bad Blood. And this is about a girl in high school who so this book is about a girl in high school who has to kind of figure out like a murder mystery. So I am excited to read this one. And these are all three highly suggested books on the internet. And they all are also uh, New York Bet Times bestsellers. So I am excited to read these three. I'm currently reading a book right now, but once I'm done with that one, I will begin one of these three. And the last thing I got to Target is one piece of clothing. I just wanted to throw it in here really quick. It is this little floral shirt with this beautiful pinky purple 
uh, color and it says on the bottom go outside and look inside and I got it in a couple size bigger than I normally would so it'd be nice and oversized and I was thinking this color is perfect for the spring just to run around doing errands in and um just when it gets warmer in the summer and spring it just was so happy so I had to get it but that is my haul video of all the things I bought recently um from Louis Vuitton, Sephora, uh, Abercrombie and Target. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, subscribe to stick around, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!